Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be talking about Shantikai's Wild Mustang Collection. Uh, this collection has been out for a couple of months, or close to a couple of months now, and I just got my hands on it. Along with the collection, I purchased this Shantikai Future Gel Skin Foundation and also one of their Philanthropy, philanthropy blushes. So, uh, the Wild Mustang collection is really a small collection. It only has four eyeshadows and two lipsticks. Now, it's small but mighty. It does give to the Wild Horse uh, foundation, which is a really nice thing that they do. So let's start with the foundation. The foundation is a gel oil-free foundation. And my shade is in vanilla. Um, I've heard a lot of good things about it. It's been out for a few years now. I would say at least five, six years. And um, it's just my first time trying it. So let's try it. It also says to apply with fingers. So I'm going to go ahead and apply with my fingers. The shade that I chose is vanilla. And that is the shade that I was recommended through the shade finder. So... Um, I think it matches really well. It reminds me more of a skin tint than a actual foundation. So you do see the evenness on my left side of my face. It's a very light feel with a nice coverage. It looks just like my skin just better. So that's nice. It gives a little bit of luminosity. It doesn't quite cover my dark circles, but it gives just enough coverage to even out your skin tone, I'd say. So that's really nice. On the other side, I'm going to use a brush to apply. Let's do the other side. Now, I like, I actually like it applied with a brush better, I think. It feels very clean, I must say. And it also feels like it's just melting into my skin. It really feels like a second skin. So, it looks great. I think it looks very, very nice. It looks luminescent, yet it looks just like your skin. Like, just your skin. A nice version of your skin, so that's really nice. Huh. I wish I'd known about this sooner. Or at least I wish I'd tried this one. I'm going to set it with the Hourglass Loose Powder, which I love to use. Okay, much better. I think the color really looks amazing. I think the color fits perfectly. So now let's try the Wild Mustang Collection. Um, it's a beautiful collection. The packaging is amazing. Uh, the beautiful horses on the packaging is so pretty. It's so beautiful. It just looks, it looks very luxe. The packaging is, doesn't feel cheapo. And it has the engraving. So this is Bay. This is a brownie chocolatey matte. And it is a beautiful color. Now I'm going to go ahead and apply this on the outer corner of my eyes. So see, it goes on very, very smoothly. See that? It's so pretty. Do the other side. Okay, now I'm going to use the other shade. The other one is more of a luminescent, and this one is in Roan. This is a luminescent 
It's more of a champagne color. As you can see, it has a nice iridescent or luminescent look. And let's see, I'm going to apply Rhone all over my lid. Let's see, I'm going to use this one. Oh, that's pretty. It just really glided on very nicely and smoothly. Oh, that is such a pretty, pretty, pretty champagne color. It went on so nicely, but it's not glittery. It's just a, a very fine, a very fine uh, glitter, whatever you call it, micro glitters. And it's so pretty. Wow, I love it. Just goes on so nicely. It almost looks wet. Almost. Just to give it a little bit of depth. Okay. Now we're going to try the lipsticks. Now these are called the Lip Veils. One is Wild Begonia and one is Laurel. Begonia is more of a deeper pink. And Bay is a more of a nude pink. I'm sorry, Laurel is more of a nude, nude pink. So let's try Wild Begonia for you. It definitely feels more like a lip balm. It's not creamy like a, like a lipstick, like a regular lipstick, but it does feel like a balm, which is, it feels more moisturizing than a lipstick, if that makes sense. It goes on nicely, nice pigment. And I like the color. It actually has sort of a gel feel to, to it as well. So this is Wild Begonia. I like it. I think it's a pretty color. I think it's a really nice, maybe go into a fall color. Very nice. Now let's try. Also, the lipstick feels substantial and it has that magnet which I love I like that click very cool now let's try Laurel let me take this off okay so Laurel is more of a pinky nude I'm gonna try it same feel but definitely more of a nude these go on so easily too it's like a bomb Exactly like a bomb. Feels nice, moisturizing and hydrating. And this is Laurel. Uh, and the last thing I purchased was also the Philanthropy Cheek Shade, Cheek and Be Emotion. Comes in these cute little containers. Now these containers just feel a little bit plasticky to be quite honest. Um, but the inside is so cute. It has a bee with a golden, a gold dust to it. And this is in golden coral. Just a little bit. Yeah, that's actually really pretty. The other side.
so that's a really pretty curly shade. And what else? Let me apply some concealer. Because so all these pesky dark circles, just a little bit. That's enough. So that is it guys. That is the Wild uh, Mustang collection. I think it's a beautiful collection. It is small but mighty because it also supports the American Wild Horse campaign, which is amazing. Um, also, what I like the most about the products that I wore today is really the foundation. I really love the foundation. It goes so light. It looks amazing and it looks just like your skin. There's no covering of the skin and it feels very nice and very light as if it melts right into your skin. So you don't really even feel the foundation, but you look great. Um, the lipsticks are very, they're pretty colors. Um, they're pretty colors and they feel like a bomb. They do feel very moisturizing and moisturizing and hydrating. The eyeshadows, the eyeshadows are, packaging is what attracted me the most for these. I love the packaging and the color, the chocolatey, the, uh, what is it, bay? Bay is probably um, the one that I like the most. I love that rich chocolatey brown. Um, they go on very nicely. The, what's the other one? The other one is uh, Roan. Roan is really pretty, it goes on. It's not a, like a harsh glitter, it's a very fine glitter that makes your um, eye look just, um, it looks elevated, it looks really pretty. So that I like. And the cheek, the blush. The blush is pretty, I love the packaging. I think with the, the, the Shanta Kai products that I purchased, I think the packaging is the winning aspect on it, of it, in my opinion. Um, but also the products perform very well. And that is it guys. I hope you liked this video and I hope you come back. Please subscribe, please like, and I'll see you next time. Have a beautiful day.